45-year-old Alberto Flores has been in Macau Medical surrounded by loved ones since Friday. He's been on life support since the accident, but yesterday his condition took a turn for the worst. Heriberto Flores, also known as Batito, was loved by many in his community. His untimely death has taken many by surprise. I, I, I saw him last night and <laughs> I just couldn't believe it. It's hard for us. Hector Trevino is his cousin and neighbor. He says Batito always knew how to light up a room. And it's, it's hard to lose someone like that. Petito loved to sing. His favorite band, El Tigres del Norte. His smile, his, his corridos, he's all, always singing to us. He was always uh, trying to make us happy, like uh, trying to different things. He was a big, big Coyote fan, a big Coyote fan. And he was all, all into football. Flores worked for the school district and was a La Jolla High School graduate. He was walking home from a football game Friday night when he was hit by a car while crossing the expressway. Saturday, Batito was declared brain dead. His family says as a way of giving back to the community he loves so much, Batito will donate his organs. Everybody loved him here in the neighborhood. We're going to miss him. He's going to be greatly missed. The Texas Organ Sharing Alliance tells the Flores family and Petito's donations will benefit six to ten people. His funeral will be held on Tuesday at three o'clock at Our Lady Queen of Angels Church in La Jolla. In the studio, I'm Ashley Custer, Action 4 News.